All right, uh, here's a little mid-trade update. We're, uh, we did take 27 long on the bonds. Uh, we weren't able to get our fantasy entry uh, quite where we wanted. Uh, it bounced right off that five-day pivot, started headed north. So we went ahead and jumped in at the uh, 27 level. Took a little bit of heat because we actually got in on the way down. Uh, so we were a little early on that, didn't catch the bottom, but uh, we just had our risk reward of two to one print. And uh, normally we would take some off right there because, uh, you know, when you get two to one, the trader's equation says that uh, you want to protect some of those profits. But uh, we, we're actually trading uh, using an intraday chart to uh, scalp our way into a swing trade on the daily chart. So if you look at the right-hand side, we're still looking for that 157 area, and we have a good entry. So at this point, we're not taking any action as far as taking profits. We're going to see what happens. We'll see how they close. Uh, you know, Maybe we end up taking some off just to lock in a few uh, ticks so we can handle any swings that, that occur overnight. Uh, D's original plan was uh, if we get up to 56, that we would go ahead and uh, sell some calls up at the 5758 area looking for uh, some protection uh, for those profits. Now, uh, I'll, I'll update at the end of the day with uh, D if she takes any action, but my guess is we're probably done on the push for now, and we'll have to wait and see uh, what the equities do uh, to wag the dog on uh, the, this next move up. But so far, so good on the entry. Uh, we'll probably not let this trade come back and hurt us. Uh, so stops to break even at this point, and we'll see what happens next. But uh, again, if you're uh, playing more conservative, and it, it, if we weren't being so greedy looking for that 157 print, that now's the time when you take one off or take two-thirds off so that you go ahead and pocket that profit because you, you've made two times your risk and your plan's working. But th this is the uh, the system that makes D so profitable and you know such a, a fun uh, trader to watch is that she will use intraday charts uh, to catch uh, trends that end up showing up on the daily charts. You know, if you want to catch a two ATR trade. You know, we're looking for that $3 move. And the only way you're going to catch a $3 move is to scalp your way into it and, you know, try and catch that bottom or catch those in, those critical turns, which is what we did down here at this five-day pivot. So here's hoping the, uh, the pivot turns into a good support and we push on up to at least the 56 areas and so we can lay off a little bit of calls and see if we can uh, make some big monies.